What's going on guys? It's me, Mr. No Nonsense, with our first video. Today we're going to be looking at Morgan Dollars. I have two of them. And the reason we're starting with Morgan Dollars is that it's the coin that got me into coin collecting in general. And so we're going to be looking at the first coin I ever collected, and then my favorite Morgan Dollar. So let's take a look. Alright, first up, we have this, my 1898 Morgan Dollar. And just a heads up, guys, I don't use flips, I don't keep things mint. That's just, you know, I like to touch all my silver. You can see there's no mint mark on it, which is fine, but it's in pretty good nick, as they say. And this is the coin that got me into coin collecting in general. What a good looking coin. And then we have my favorite Morgan Dollar, an 1890 uh, San Francisco Mint that someone Maybe a long time ago, maybe recently. I wouldn't know. I only picked this one up oh, six months ago, maybe, before the situation happened. But someone just took a whole bunch of, you know, I don't remember what they're called off the top of my head now. Um, punches, yeah, letter punches to it. All over the face and some, you know, square punches, it looks like, all over the back. And I don't know. I think it gives the coin a whole bunch of character. And, you know, that's why it's my favorite. Now is the uh, little trivia part of our videos. So, let me inform you guys. Uh, the Morgan Dollar was minted from 1878 to 1904, and once more in 1921. And it was also the first standard silver dollar minted since production of the ceded Liberty dollar, due to the passage of the Coinage Act of 1873. They are obviously 90% silver, so that's always fun. The min mint marks include Philadelphia, which is no mint mark, which is that one. We have a double C for Carson City. We have an S for San Francisco, which is that one. We have an O for New Orleans, or New Orleans. And we have D for Denver. And the other, the big story with the Morgan dollars that, you know, in the early 60s, a large amount of uncirculated, uncirculated Morgan dollars in their original bags were discovered in treasury vaults, including ones that they thought were rare. And then people started to buy large quantities and, you know, then the treasury stopped exchanging silver certificates for them. And in the early 70s, the Treasury conducted a sale of silver dollars minted at Carson City Mint through GSA. And in 06, the Morgan's reverse design was used on a silver dollar issued to commemorate the old San Fran Mint building. So you guys get some time, check out a picture of that. I don't know, I don't own any coins with any commemorative silver coins or anything like that but all right that wraps up our first video the morgan dollars uh shout out to some of the people who inspired me to start making videos uh bradley's coins check him out uh bohemian staxity always check him out uh america silver patriot who's been a great donator on bradley's uh channel he's wonderful and i'll catch you guys on the next one